No more stuff spoiling everyone's broadcasting. There's an article in the paper. I'm a radio broadcaster, Skeleton Nation. There's an article in the paper. Raw milk sickens children. You know how dumb it is to drink, to drink milk? How dumb to use it at all? Dairy use in this. Humans are so stupid that they use dairy. Now, say you use it. The dumb idea in the first place. You want calcium, you certainly don't get it from dairy. A broadleaf plant. Lettuce has more calcium than milk. A lot less acid producing mucus. Nevertheless, pasteurize it for Christ's sake. You know, they go to hell for praying and the prayer life is garbage and the child dies or gets hurt. And they're held responsible because they don't know how to pray. Basically. And I don't know that any praying works if it ever did. Do you? I never did see it work. I never can say, test you that I saw someone healed with prayer. Believe me, I'll get quite excited. I do. Only I more than likely got tricked. <laughs> yep. I just didn't know it. Now, you tend to say that. Well, it's obvious. Those people are held liable for endangering their children, and you can feed your child raw milk and not get held liable. To me, if you fed your child raw milk and that child got sick with E. coli, boy, I tell you, community service or something, <laughs> you need something going on. Wake you up. What kind of chores to get you to stop and think that you don't do that to your kid? Oh, uh, baloney. You know, First of all, your child doesn't even belong living. You aren't going to be able to prepare it to not get go through hell. It's going to go through hell. Second, to give your child mucus crap at the first place coming out of the... Eh, I eat it. I'm an idiot. I remember for years I didn't. Now as an old man, I'm eating. I got a fondant for cheese. What a moron. Although I'll tell you this much. I have a terrible stomach. There's times my stomach says, give me that. Because I go test a bunch of cheese at a certain store. And they sell little bits and pieces of it. A very expensive cheese that I get a little corner where I don't have to spend $8 or $9 for a piece of cheese. I can buy it for a dollar and a half. $20 cheese I can get for three bucks. It's $20 cheese. And I'll tell you what it has in it. Enzymes. And my gut goes, and it likes me eating them. It sure does. Dairy. And I don't do well on dairy. And yet the enzymes in that cheese, my gut sure likes. It sure does. I don't think you're going to get that out of milk. Nope. you got to let it ferment and build enzyme. And it's the enzyme you want. And what a way to get it. What a way to get it! Well, okay, fermenting bacteria is what humans have to eat. Cross-breeding. In such ways, you ain't got the brains to figure it out. That's what you have to eat. Nine feet deep. Mm hmm In topsoil. And you eat the product of that. Do you understand me? No matter what it is. Eat it. It's crawling. Eat it. <laughs> it looks like spinach in a can and I'm Popeye. Yep. Come here. Ah! Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. Don't. I came up with that one. That was not your idea, Peeper. I am smarter than my Pooka. I quit it. I quit it. I'm smarter. I quit. I am smarter than my Pooka.
there's an ongoing thing here, and I've been, I'm 67 years old. This sucker invented me to generations. I've evolved and, ah, uh, <laughs> oh, <boogie God. laughs> help me. My God, somebody. <laughs> You're an idiot! You see what I go through? This happens at night sometimes in my bed. I roll into my hands and grab my face and everything. Ah! I warned the Lord one of these days, I'm telling You do this stuff in secret, I'm coming public with it. <laughs> They'll understand, they'll believe me. Why? Because we're presidents. <laughs> it seems kind of like that. <laughs> That's what the great spirit. You know that movie, My Fellow Americans. We'll go public. <laughs> yeah, Jack Robinson. We'll go public. They'll believe us. Why? Because we're presidents. <laughs> I'm the. I'm the. I know you'll believe me, I'm the last remaining monarch, I'm Jewish. Jews don't lie. We do not lie. I know not where Joseph went. He must have got lost. He was talking about, he was talking out of his head again, you know how, you know how they, oh man, dad, I don't know where he went. Ah, very Jewish, right? Yeah, no. All right, all right, all right. We're picking on my family members. Well, I like them. Never mind. Never mind. The Lord has got nothing. Listen, the God of the Jew is, there's more Gentiles than there is Jews. So the God is God, everybody's God. So the God of the Jew is really the God of the Gentiles, and we're the minority. Simple as that. And we don't need a promised land because we're the, the idiots. Right? And everyone takes care of people that, that look like the banjo player in Deliverance. What was that? All makes sense, you ask me.